Hey, what's going on? You know who it is. You know what it is. All right, you guys, peep game. So there seemed to be a ginormous or a super free throw difference or deficiency or free throw equality, whatever you want to call it, when it comes to last night's game with the Warriors and the Lakers. It appears that the Lakers were 25 of 29. The Warriors were five of six. So the Warriors did not go to the free throw very much last night versus the previous series versus the Sacramento Kings. Um, At the end of the day, I'm not crying. I'm just putting this out there. I have a right to bring this to the public's attention. And this is what certain people were talking about. People was like, my God. And if you look at Stephen Curry, Stephen Curry don't go to the line as much as he should. Because I didn't see Stephen Curry get hammered and not get a call. He got hammered about at least three or four times in the closeout game versus the Sacramento Kings. And he he didn't get his calls. And he was even looking at the referees and they wouldn't call it. But at the end of the day, this is where people start thinking, OK, hey, this is why some people believe the, the league is, is rigged and why they want certain teams to go to the finals every year. And when you see things like this, you start like, hmm. I mean, keep in mind, Stephen Curry's own wife said she believed that, you know, it was some some suspicious activity in that series with the Cleveland Cavaliers versus the Golden State Warriors. And then if you look at some other stuff previously with with draft picks and lottery and all that kind of stuff. So it does raise the questions at the end of the day. They can't do what they want to do. Like they really telling us and showing us everything. Come on, man. Let's just keep it a buck. But yeah, that's that's I don't know, man. That's real suspect, man. That is real suspect. But yeah, I needed to bring that to you guys attention, you know, because, you know, when you see stuff like that, all you want is a fair series. You know, you want it called right down the line. And I said this could be a problem. Now, don't get me wrong. Uh, still doesn't take away the fact that uh, Anthony Davis had a great game. But at the end of the day, I said this before. I just want the best team to win fair and square. This reminds me of that final series with the Miami Heat and the Dallas Mavericks. You know, with Dwayne Wade, where he won finals MVP. Uh, the calls that the Miami Heat got in that series was was amazing, to say the least. So, like I said before, this does seem like this is a issue. But let's see what happens in game two. Anyway, it's your boy Town Biz. I'm out.